everybody! As promised, today we are doing the squirrel in this Lego Creator set. It's Park Animals, set 31044. And, yeah, we're saving the best for last, of course. So, let's see, I'll put that up there just, just out of your sight. You'll still, you'll still see some instructions anyway. There we go, and we do this. Now this is the first time I've ever actually needed to use this because I had to take apart the owl in order to get the pieces I need for the squirrel. Let's see, and some of the pieces were hard to take off. So there we go. Now we know that the brick, or the brick separator is not only helpful, but necessary. As if we didn't already know that. Let's see, I need two, are those brown? I think they're, oh yeah, they're these, these sort of weird tan brown pieces. Okay, we're gonna do two of this. Let's see, and put it sort of just in the corner of those. Hmm. Oh, oh that's kind of looking like feet, yeah. Yeah, it's feet. Two of these, <clears throat> and two of these brown pieces here. Okay, this goes across here, so that gets secured. These aren't really, these are more display pieces, I think, than anything else. So, they probably don't need to be too incredibly stable. Stable enough to sit on a shelf. I don't know though. The uh, the owl had a lot of our points of articulation. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they are. Maybe they are meant to be played with. Let's see. the The puppy sure seems to have a lot of joints that move. <clears throat> This is the squirrel. This is this is my dog's favorite animal. <laughs> she loves squirrels. Whenever she sees one in the backyard, she has to go out there and chase it. And when we take her to the dog park, she has to... She spends a lot of time by trees begging squirrels to come down. It's so funny. A one by two is it an orange yeah it's an orange it's a little hard to tell colors on this but maybe maybe that's my eyes let's see I hadn't really considered that too much before someone who is colorblind would have a hard time putting these sets together because the colors aren't always um, the same on the sheet here as they are in real life. Let's see that. Ah. Unsteady hands. There we go. That goes on there. And these go here and here. I might be building this where the instructions are supposed to be. Try to keep it down here right in front of me. Let's see. Whenever I put stuff, whenever I start doing a whole lot of things up in this corner, I end up having to move them in, move the instructions in, uh, in post. <clears throat> Which kind of seems like it might be disorienting for the viewer. I don't know. It's not something I want to do This goes here, and this goes here. And two of these dudes here. And how? Just like that, just like that. Let's see, there goes the air conditioning. 
it has been chilly lately. Autumn has definitely begun, which makes this set actually all the more appropriate because, I don't know, the park, autumn, maybe it's not all the more appropriate, but it seems like it should be. Let's see, here's this spinny piece. So the instructions are assuming that this is the first thing I've built or that I've completely taken this apart too. But no, saving myself a step. And one of these, a bunch of white pieces here. Okay, that goes like that, that goes like that, and that goes on there, like so. What's next? Let's see. Next, we do a little thing. Here, dark colored thing, light colored thing, and brown thing. And oh, we're going to be mirroring. So let's do, let's do another set of all of this. Let's see. There we go. We got two arms. Two arms. Well, we don't have them yet, but we will. Okay, this goes like this. I'm going to do sort of these two steps together. That goes like that. See, because now they're mirrored. And this goes across here. So this one goes across here. Brown piece here brown piece here. Then what? Then what? Then we put them on like this. You see? And then you sort of angle them so that he's awkwardly holding his arms or like he's holding a, a nut or something. What a nut. Okay, then this boat piece, <clears throat> and then one of these, and then a green piece, gotta have some green, there we go, actually the green isn't even shown, so this is, that makes sense though, because what part of a squirrel is green? No part, that's what, there we go. Oh, is this the tail, or...? Yeah, I think this is going to be the tail. Okay, this goes on here. <clears throat> yeah, okay, okay. Two of these, two of these little one-by-threes. There we go. Then what? One of these, and a couple of wings. Um, orange wings? Uh, no, no, no these sort of tan wings. Yeah. Okay, so this goes here. And the tan wings go like this. And this. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay, and then these go across. There we go. <coughs> And then one of these. And then that goes on the end of that. So this squirrel might be a little difficult to balance because the tail is so elaborate. Okay, one of these. Oh, another boat piece. Got a couple of boat pieces in this set. That's cool. <clears throat> and then this thing. Okay, we need six pieces. We have four so far. All right. So two more, because four minus two plus two is six. Four minus negative two is six. We actually need seven, because we need two of these. Okay, what do we do? We do this, and we do this, and then we do these two, and then we do one of these yep 
and then this. It doesn't look, oh, I guess it does look like a tailpiece. There we go. Tail is complete. Now we're gonna do the head. Yeah, let's just do this all in one, one video. Might run a little long, so I hope you don't mind. Hope you don't have anything pressing to do today because now you're stuck here. Gotta keep watching this video till it's over. You don't really. Let's see. Let's go back here. And then two more of these cool things. Ever so useful. Um, how do they go? Oh, they go like this. Mm -hmm. Hopefully you can see those pieces. Okay, now we need an orange and one of these front of a car pieces. The front of a car piece goes there so that you got this going. And the orange piece goes back here. And then what? Then you do this. That right there. Alright, a couple of these. There and there. And then once. Okay, turn this thing around. Uh, one of these and one of these white pieces. This white piece goes on top of there and that goes in there to be grabbed grabularly by a grabbing grabber okay there and there oh, we're really uh, doing a number on this okay one of these goes on here not really not doing a number but you know this is kind of an elaborate thing oh this must be the head of course of course last orange piece oh two of these front of a car pieces they're not just for the front of a car that's interesting okay one of these goes on the white thing here, like that. Then what? Then what? One of these, one of these, and one of these. So, this does this, this does this, and this does this. Doesn't look at all like a squirrel's head so far. Okay, um. Then. This goes on here, like this. Yep. Hmm. Okay. Then this sort of sticks all that together, as you can see. As you can plainly see, I have a feeling we're going to be mirroring this, uh, this step, but I can't see it on the next page yet, so we'll just keep doing this normal. Oh, only needed one of those. Okay. Like that. Oh, then we put... Then we get an eye, so this is indeed going to start looking like a squirrel. They want it sort of angled up. Whatever you want to do. I'm going to do it like this, though. Oh, I see. I see. It does look like a squirrel. See, that? there's the mouth. You can probably see it by now. Okay, turn this around. It's like a little chubby-cheeked um, squirrel. Okay, that goes down there. This goes across here. 
another eyeball, a little eye. We've got these two huge eyes that we used for the that we used for the owl, but um, squirrels don't have eyes that big. Okay, now I guess ears are going to be going on this. So that goes there. That goes there. And this goes in the back. And this goes in the front. In the back and in the front. In the picture here, the squirrel looks a little bit angry, but my squirrel in person looks happy. I'm sure they meant it to look happy. Because squirrels seem like happy little fellows. Maybe slightly nervous. But they're basically prey animals, so of course they're nervous. They have a lot to be nervous about. They're so tasty to so many things. Never eaten one myself. Oh, it says times two, so that's good to know. But there are people who eat squirrel. There we go. Two of those that are probably almost done. Okay, that goes on there. That goes on there. And they flip up because they're listening for owls, I guess. <laughs> Good thing I took the owl apart before I started building this. We would have had some trouble on our hands. Are we done? Are we done? Yes, we're done with this. We're finally finished. Isn't that cool? The head moves around. The tail moves too. The arms semi-move. You can... You could probably pose him a little bit. His feet don't move though, so you know, he'll he'll sit flat though, that's cool. There we have it! The squirrel from Lego Creator Park Animals. I will see you next time when we build the puppy and the duck. The ducks. Be there. <laughs>